Ask Reddit by Professor Wolf02. Girls, what was the most obvious hint you dropped, and the guy just didn't get it? I once asked a guy if I could kiss him. We had been hanging out in a way that was conducive to that, and he said yes. I kissed him. It was great. But then we just parted ways in a natural way. Three days later, this man calls me all shocked that I was hitting on him. He told a friend about the interaction and they had to point it out. So, I literally kissed you. I'm sitting here laughing only because, yes as men we are that oblivious. The missed opportunities over the years are just mind blowing. I asked him out on a movie date after already spending hours talking to him just the two of us. I had already given him lots of compliments, told him how I loved to be around him, how I really enjoyed his company. During the date, I paid for the tickets, he paid the snacks, I went to sit closer and tried to grab his hand. He genuinely thought I just wanted the armrest and moved away from me. I had to literally tell him I had feelings for him after the movie, and even then he asked me what I meant. We're married now, have two kids, and I know he'll never cheat because he'll never ever notice anyone flirting with him, and you know, trust and loyalty. You literally told the man you had feelings for him and he still didn't get the hint? After dinner and drinks, I asked if he wanted to go back to my place and watch Bob's Burgers. He said he didn't really like cartoons. I said we don't have to watch anything, we can do other things. He replied then what would we do with a genuinely puzzled expression. I figured it was clear he wasn't interested and figured we had fun and called it a night, especially since he had mentioned wanting to beat that traffic getting home. Kinda bummed but I figured life goes on and then 20 minutes later he texted me and said not gonna lie, I wanted you so badly tonight. I was like I didn't think so, because I invited you up and you declined, and suddenly he realized I was inviting him for 6. He flipped out and asked if he could come back over lol. He did, and finally got it, and we had snacks and drinks and sex. Dated for a few months. Pretty cool guy, but absolutely clueless. Dude was probably thinking oh if I say I don't want to be stuck in traffic, she may have me stay the night, smooth move. I once asked a guy straight up if he wanted to FCK me and then he laughed and kept talking about something else. Then an hour later, he called and asked if I was serious, to which I said yes. And he was like oh I didn't know that was an actual option. And did he? My now wife and her friend tried to get me to go out with both of them to a movie that I'd been talking about wanting to see for weeks. I declined, I don't want to be a third wheel. But they said they already had tickets. I thought they were just being nice and I didn't want to intrude in their girls night. I said they could return my ticket but thanks so much anyway. I'm a fool on so many levels. Hey, sounds like it all worked out for you though. Had my crush over and we were sitting in my living room and I looked at him in a manner I felt was admiring and said I do like it when you come to visit. And bless him he looks up and smiles and says I like visiting too. So I say but I really like it when you come to visit. And he smiles wider and says I really like it too and goes back to what he was doing and says no more. I've been out of the game too long. I suck at this. How did it end? Did he ever realize? Getting my tits out. That's not a hint. That's two very strong arguments. We'd been flirting for months. I told him I was going out for dinner. Did he want to come too? He declined. I figured that he wasn't interested and it was just fun flirting. Not real flirting. Oh well. Years later he asked me if I was asking him out. When I said I totally was. He was just OMG. I didn't realize until like a week later and practically died of shame because I was into you. We were with different people by then and had a good chuckle about it. That sucks. I hate that this entire post is just different versions of I didn't think she could be into me. Because it's me.
I'm as dense as a black hole and this thread hurts a lot. Two nights ago I asked my boyfriend, can I get some of that and touched his crotch. After about 30 minutes of weirdness, I said hey it's okay if you don't want to do anything, let's just go to bed, and he hit me back with a wait I didn't know you wanted 6, why didn't you say anything? My bf the other night was like what do you wanna do tonight and I said, you. I took my whole shirt off for him to treat my sunburn, he was flabbergasted to say the least. His dad even suggested he should do it in the first place, I visited his family over summer break. His dad even suggested he slept with me in the guest room opposed to his own as it was cooler there. People kept making remarks, he asked me if it bothered me, I said no I don't mind it. He made a whole speech in front of everyone to stop it. Made me think I was the stupid one lol. Took him 3 months to catch up to what everyone was seeing in a second. He was thinking wow, I'm so deep in the friend zone that she doesn't blink and I at taking her shirt off in front of me. I'd better not be creepy since I don't want to ruin this friendship. Told a dude I loved him, he laughed and said I was funny thought that meant he wasn't interested. He ended up asking me out an hour later when I asked what changed. He said he told his mom and sister what I said and talked some sense into him. It's a good thing at least he did listen to two women who had his best interest at heart. That's encouraging. I laid on top of him, fully clothed, we were just hanging out, looked him dead in the face, and said, hey, I like you as more than a friend and would like to kiss your face. And it still took him a week. Together for 8 years, married for 2. I've been reading this whole thread out loud to my husband and we're having the best time, and this is the one that made him exclaim out loud. We have to know, what was his response in the moment? And for the next 6 days? Are you sure that he knows that you two are married? Because honestly, it does seem like you're just being nice. I would like to think it was Buzz me missing the hint, but no, it was clueless me. With friends group at a bar. Hot girl and I were flirty, I chalked it up to booze. Some other rando makes horrid comments, she's in tears, wants to go. I volunteer as her apt is on my way. Walk her to her door, she insists I come in for coffee to wake me up. Sure, coffee sounds good. Then nope, after coffee she thinks I should sleep there to be safe. I'm welcome to share the bed, but she sleeps in the nude so I do, too. She literally had to say she wanted to f because I was not getting it. I mean, I honestly would have assumed she was one of those nudists and that she was well aware I'd get horny so was giving me a heads up to not get any ideas if I was allowed to sleep over. I actually asked my now husband out on our first couple of dates. And asked him to marry me. Been married 23 years soon. Pretty sure he still doesn't get it sometimes. Does he know he is married? This thread's gonna hurt. I always realize I'm being hit on like, years later. Full years. Just hits me all at once. Oh well. It's either going to be how did I miss that or none of this ever happens to me. Being naked on the side of the bed putting lotion on. He went to sleep. Why are you all liking this? In college a girl asked me up to her room to watch Elf since I had never seen it. Part way and she stops the movie to tell me her breasts are different sizes and asked if I wanted to see. I said sure and she took her top off. Sure enough one was a little bit bigger. She told me to feel the difference in weight and I did. Sure enough one was heavier. I then assumed that was the end and went back to watching Elf. You're a cotton headed ninny muggins. Asked a dude what he'd do if I had feelings for him while we were slow dancing and right after asking him to promise me he won't forget about me after he moves, we were 13 btw lol, and he basically said I know a girl like you could never like me. Should have told him, well, it did. Not exactly the ask. But way I was oblivious as a lesbian, girl I was friends with, and knew liked women, was holding my hands and kissing me on the cheek. 
openly flirting with me and referring to me as her wife. I actually thought she meant it in an intense female friendship way until we came back from a thing with friends and she said she hoped I we would be close when we were old. It just hit me all at once how stupid I was. Honestly don't know what the hang up was. My one point of defense is that she didn't openly ever ask me out. She just started acting in a certain way towards me. My line of reasoning was that she was very attentive with her other friends and if she wanted to date she would say it. I'm still an idiot though. The first one on one date with my wife was at the public swimming pool. She was grinding me underwater, asking if her breasts look okay in her bikini and all that. When we wanted to leave the pool I said we had to wait a minute before I could get out of the pool because well, a obvious reason. She suggested change in the same changing room and she got naked in front of me but with her back towards me. I was quite confused but I respected her and didn't touch her. When we got at her house I would stay the night there on the sofa because her mom would be home. Her mom, a great wing woman as it turns out, said that she would sleep at her boyfriend's place so we had the house for herself. Still no bell. She left and my wife said she was going to shower but asked if I could come with her because sometimes she fainted in the shower. I was standing outside the shower, here against the daughter Liz. I really love these stories. So many earnestly kind dudes here. I picture you on full alert for a possible medical incident while this chick is in the shower. I'm glad she married you. Before I dated my ex, we were good friends. I spent the night at his place one time after we hung out with friends since I didn't want to go home. I had a crush on him for a few weeks by then and he, apparently, was into me for years. Anyway, I slept in his bed and he was going to sleep on a couch. I was a bit drunk and so I had the courage to ask him come sleep with me he replied no. Thinking I was joking. To be fair if a drunk girl says to sleep with her, whether joking or not. It's best we say no to avoid her our at pay charge. When I was 17, I gave a female co-worker a ride home. She said it was hot in her apartment and took off her shirt. I offered to lower the thermostat facipum. Not a girl, but it happened with a friend. A girl invited him to a dinner at her place, then after some Netflix she got under the blanket and challenged him to guess if she'd be able to get naked under the blanket right there without him noticing. Granted, it was nearly first such interaction he was completely clueless and just discarded that as goofing around with a friend. Edit, I can't spell even with the autocomplete. Oof. I got secondhand cringe from this one. Somewhere there's a comic where the last panel is the guy on his deathbed. He suddenly sits up, says, oh my god, she was totally hitting on me and then expires. Looked for it but couldn't find it a while back, 